a solemn prayer and memorial service for the traders who lost their lives at Sunbeam Business Complex was held today as those affected recounted their heartbreaking accounts of what happened during the fateful day. A Sunbeam business community joined the families of the victims who lost their lives during the recent looting and arson attacks on the complex. We get more from our very own Ben Kirui. Along Mfangano Street in Nairobi Central Business District, the remains of the once vibrant Sunbeam Business Mall stand as a somber reminder. It is well with my soul. On Wednesday, the Sunbeam Business community gathered in solemnity to honor the lives lost during the looting and as an attack that disrupted business at the mall. <laughs> At the emotional memorial service, families of the three victims, Fanta Leo Nakura, Bernard Mungai, and Matthew Njoroge, shared their moving accounts of that fateful day. <laughs> The distraught widows of Nakura, a Tanzanian national, and Jiroge recounted the harrowing journey of discovering the charred bodies of their kids more than a week later. Kuna kitana alikutoka dodoma nilimpigia simu kamwambia kuja nitusaidiane wakatimbua ndo after kumaliza kutoa hiyo mchanga ilikuwa hapo ndani wakamkosa soja akamwambia kawaita akamwambia hapo kando kuna kitu anaona ndio akasema kumbe alikuwa ni yeye ndo akwa na kichwa akwa na migu kabidi watoto ende DNA my son Chege na Chege ndio alikuta baba yake amelala kama ameangalia na chini akamgeuza wasichana wakakaa hapo kwa baba yao Karo and Catherine wakasema ona baba yetu bado kichwa ni moto The ceremony culminated in a candlelit tribute where grieving families and business community members placed the candles and wreaths at the ground floor of the building, each a candle and floral tribute symbolizing a final farewell to their fallen colleagues. Matthew Njoroge was laid to rest last week, while preparations are underway for Bernard Mungai's funeral scheduled for this Friday. The family of Fanta Leo Nakura is making arrangements to transport his body to Tanzania. Amoja. Sunbeam Business Community stands united in remembrance of those who lost their lives during the looting and arson attack on this commercial building. Despite the tragedy, they remain resolute and hopeful, believing they will rise again from the ruins. Ben Kirui, Citizen TV, Nairobi.